guys, it's Alice here, and today we will be talking about the rarest horses in Star Stable. So let's get straight into it. June the 26th, 2019, the bar carts were available for a limited time only. They were released in preparation for the Midsummer event and were leaving on July the 24th. Star Stable actually made these horses the first limited time purchasable horses, meaning these would never return to the game and would never be able to be purchased again after this time. The only reason these horses are so rare and limited now is because back when they were released, Star Stable intended them to come back every year like Talina and Campos, but players thought it was a one-time buy and bought Starcoin specifically for these horses. This unfortunately was not the case, as Star Stable wanted them to come back every year, but players thought these were specifically limited. So Star Stable made sure these horses were never to be released again so that players wouldn't get confused. <laughs> The Texas Bluebell was another horse that was available for a limited time only, similar to the bar cards. First shown on June the 19th, 2019, these horses were available in the horses app where you could train it up just to level 10. The Texas Bluebell was also only available till July the 1st. This was also the first limited time horse with a story quest and was intended to never be released again after July 1st. Spirit was bought into Star Stable on May the 26th, 2017 and left permanently on May 29th, 2019. This was a horse brought into SSO in collaboration with DreamWorks, an animated show called Spirit Riding Free. Instead of buying Spirit right then and there, players had to ride around the map and try find Spirit in areas. You had to get reputation and get admired with Spirit in order to tame him with an apple that cost around 699 star coins. He appeared every hour from 8 a.m. to 10 p.m. and gave players 750 reputation points. There was also a shop within Fort Pinta that would give you limited time riding tack and accessories, but unfortunately you could not put any tack or change the hair on Spirit. The Generation 1 Fjords were introduced on December the 10th, 2014. Just like Spirit, the Fjord horses were obtained by becoming popular with the cultist people. After becoming popular, you were able to purchase these amazing horses and keep them for yourself. But on the 20th of September 2018, Star Stable announced that the Generation 1 Fjords were to be removed from the game. I don't think this has ever happened before, but I guess Star Stable was making it so they could bring in the new Fjords. The Generation 1 Fjords left Jorvik along with the Cultus people on October 10th, 2018 and never to be seen again making these horses pretty rare after the date they were taken out of the game. The Jorvik Stables Open House holds a few rare horses, only available to purchase within this time period. The Open House usually only comes around once or twice a year and stays for a week or two. This year on July the 21st, we were lucky enough to get a new rare horse that was limited to the event only, the New Arabian model, along with the other models such as the three Libelizana horses and the three Andalusians. These horses will always come back every year, so there's no worry that we won't see these gorgeous horses next year. Anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed this video and let me know down below if I missed any rare horses or any horses that won't be coming back to Star Stable like the old Generation 1 Fjord horses. And if you enjoyed this video, please give it a like and subscribe if you guys are new here and I'll see you guys all in the next video. Goodbye!